so we're gonna give him one. And then we got Gordon's gonna help, and then we got Shar's gonna help because Vic needs court positioning. Let's think while you talk. Where do you want me? Uh, let's go this side. Yeah, for a while it was just me and Char and Mark Honeycutt. Uh, yeah, I wanted to come over to the Huh? Yeah, you know, decent player, lots of fun. I like his attitude. It's just he's uh, smiling and laughing. Sorry. Oh, I was gonna go. Crazy, silly. You know? Yeah, that dude's gonna have a good time. He's not as serious as me. So remember, with the wind at your back, Vic, yep. we kind of want to tend to let it bounce more. I think we went over that last time. Nice. Hey, Gordon listens. <laughs> that's coming. Well, you do, and then you don't. But that's that 4-0, you know. You're. Yeah, you can play really well. You know how to play, but then it's being able to put it together. Consistently, yeah. Right, you shouldn't. Miss. Like doing this, you should never miss, right? Yeah. For me, when I miss, it's because I'm not focused. I'm not looking at the ball. My mind's somewhere else. Yeah, I got you. Uh, go ahead and go there. This side. So Vic, where where those pictures from when it was iced over? Oh, there's uh, that's my place that we have in Michigan. Michigan, okay. I was just, I was just telling you guys, whatever you do, don't complain about where you're at. All right. Yeah, that's uh, we have a place on uh, on uh, we sold our house on the river, and we bought this place here, and. Uh, we had a place uh, on an inland lake. It's got a state park right on the west side of it. 13 mile lake on the, on the side of the pictures on the river. Yeah. So we decided to build our river house and So you like yeah. coming back for our fa smiling faces? Okay, one of the things is I, I, I'm always unsure of when to change the direction. You know? Yes. I mean, this is so much fun here, but you know, when do you decide? So who's, who was on offense and who was on defense there? Well, do you feel like you were in control of the dink or he was in control of the dink? No, I felt like he was probably more in control of the dink. Then that's when you change it. Okay. Yep. If you feel he's defending still, you just keep going at it. No reason to change at all. It, yep. Once he makes you defend, that's the time to switch it. Yep. No reason to switch it if you are in charge, you know? If you feel like you're winning, yeah, you stay with it. Stay with it. And once you feel... Yeah. <laughs> Once you feel that uh, okay. he's pushing you around, then you want to change it. And then you can always just go back, right? You can change one and then keep going back. So 
know, that's that's one of the main ways I change the cook. If they put me on defense. You always play when you're in a dinking match if the ball if the ball ends up I mean are you always trying to stay side by side or should put one person in back So let me go on that side, Gordon. Okay, so this is the main thing we're going to cover today. Is wherever this ball is depends on our positioning. So if that ball's in front of me in the dynamite doubles, I am the blocker workhorse. The I'm the hunter. You're, you're the hunter, right? Yeah. So I'm looking for anything in the air to attack. I want to be super aggressive. Your position should be right here as the backup. You're the workhorse. You're going to get lobs. You're just going to reset dinks. You know, try to get it back in front of your hunter. So I may be, I may be. You're uh, off the line. I'm off the line a little bit. Yeah. So if I'm here, get in your position. And if I go my backhand, your forehand. Yep. We need to cover that gap. Yep. Okay. So the main thing in this, yes. So you would scoot okay, over so a little. I need to be even, even, even closer. closer. Yeah. Even though that leaves me vulnerable here, but that's a pretty tough shot. It's a tough shot. Okay. Yeah. And, and I should have time to get there. Yeah. We don't even worry about shots that they haven't even shown us they can make yet okay you know okay so we don't worry about that so if i'm here you're in front of the ball here let's switch oh. sides now you're the hunter so now if this ball bounces that's my ball yep. if it comes in the air then you want to take it you're looking to you're looking to smash that ball out of the air that's not how you hit it Yes. Don't be afraid then to step over and get that. Yeah, yeah. Even though I'm trying to set you up. Even though it still is in this theoretical section, just because. Unless it's going to bounce, it's mine. Okay. Now, if it bounces in the kitchen, then you would come take it, but you'd have to put it back in front of yourself. So let's say you come take this. Okay, you go back over here. So you're be in the workhorse position. It's a soft ink in the kitchen. I take it and I put it back in front of myself. Yep. Then the gap is still closed. But okay. what everybody does, so give me another soft one. So they go a soft one and they put it over there. Yep. And look, I just burned our you whole just team. Burned, you just burned your, I got Yeah, you. created a hole. Okay, would it be all right if you dumped it uh, into the inside rather than the outside? So we typically want to go outside to outside, inside to outside. We typically do not want to go outside to inside. Because you get okay, because burned. Of the fact that you're trying to go from outside to inside, which might pop it up for you. It just it sets up a bad situation. Because for us, then we really don't know who the blocker workhorse is okay, in that so scenario. Inside is this is this considered inside, and this is outside, and, and this is just middle. So typically, we would have taped lines. Yep. So a tape from here yep. to here, yep. from here yeah. to here. Okay. So that would be, see how that tape go, would go to this tape, outside to outside, outside to outside, okay. outside to outside, right? Yep. Inside to outside, outside. right? Or inside here. to outside. outside. Okay. Yep. yep. Gotcha. And then in the whole other system, there would be, if we cut this kitchen, in half, right? Yep. And then cut it in half again this way. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six. So I can actually match. If he gives me a two, I can give him a two. All right. You know? If he gives me a four, I can give him a four. But it's, yeah. I don't quite have that down. It's, it's It was easier to do the outside to outside. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Does that make sense? But well, typically, and, they, and that's what they were on that dynamite. I would say, yeah, they call it they call it blocker and and workhorse rather than hunter. Yeah, she liked the hunter term yeah. also. No, I thought it was she used during her videos. She Terminator was the other one. Yeah. So Terminator, I call it hunter just because uh, I want to eat. You know, I'm a, no, I'm a meat eat. eater. I'm gonna hunt that I just that down. Like, oh my god, I'm sitting here listening to because we had talked about hunters, and she keeps saying blocker, blocker. No. So I think I even reached out to you guys yeah. because that's the same thing I think of it is each person has an outside and an inside. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm trying to go from my outside to his. Yeah. My yeah. Okay. yeah. But typically we would do it on the taped lines. You guys didn't have taped lines in your right. 
right. lesson. Seen them on the video. Yeah, but in our coaching certification, oh, we would go. It would made it simpler because you can see the lines oh, cool. where it's right. outside to outside, outside to outside. Yeah. So basically, my outside to that outside, right? Yeah. This backhand outside to his backhand outside. Yeah. Okay. So would this be okay? Since I'm here. And let's say the ball here, yep. is this considered my outside or is this my inside? Or does it make a difference? Because I'm thinking To me that's this is inside. Because you would go inside to outside. outside, outside. Yes. That's all yeah. So if I got this, yes. theoretically I could go to outside or I could go back to outside here, but I wouldn't want to go necessarily obviously right there. We don't want to go there. Because that just Oh that opens it up. Okay. Right. Because if you're the blocker, yeah. Hunter, I'm here. We're kind of going on a two-on-one scenario with this person. So if you pick that up, and you basically there. give it to a forehand that burns me. I got you. Okay. Yep. So I got you. Okay. I got you. That's just a spot I do not go yeah, no, hardly that, ever. That, yeah. That, that, that. So if you do grab one from the inside, you want to bring it back. Okay. Your inside to outside. Okay. Yep. Okay. So that would be anything in here. But typically, so let's set up a scenario. You Just do it by hand, Gordon, right now and hit like a short four and a through four. Does that make sense? So that would be yours, Vic, okay. right? Okay, so it was here, that would be mine. Yep. But I should try so we're here in a scenario, right. Yeah, if he, that could be you, right? Yep. That's me. Yep. And this was one of our, that's me. Oh, oh that's, okay, because it was deeper. It right. was bounced, it was deeper, okay. yeah. This was one of our drills we did, main drills we did in the coaching certification. So that would be you, right? That's me. That's you. Yeah, you can step in there. That's you. That's me. Okay, so that's it's a great drill that I'm gonna do with you guys at some point. Same thing over here, which is where I think people get messed up a little because you're Hi, actually giving it to, um, his back, you're letting forehand go to his back. Tent, yes. Right? So let's say I'm I'm Hunter right now, right? I'm looking for anything in the air. If it's soft here, I can go get it. There we go. There we go. No, that's yours. That's yours. That's mine. That's you. See, this is just a great drill. It's there. You go. So okay, good. So now let's just play. Oh wait, this side. Are you? So let's play. Let's play the soft game real quick. Do you remember this one? Have we played yep. this one? Yep. Okay. Five alive. So serve one, two, three, four. The fish shot. The whole court's open. So it's, it's the one we've been yep. playing. Serve in one, two, three. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Now it's, that's alive. So try to work on blocker workhorse now. Zero, zero. You got it. You got it. So you hit that. You just need to stop and get low because it's it's coming at your feet for the most part, yep. right? Uh, zero, zero. Okay, zero, zero. Nice. Was I supposed to dink it back or hit it? No, it, it was the court was open oh, at that point. Open. Yep. So one zero two. One, two, three, four, five. So 
So here, since you're the blocker here, I can, oh. yeah. So look, I'm in the middle with you. You grabbed it and you just burned me. Okay. Right? You went behind me. That's what you told me. I did. Yes. So if you do grab that out of the kitchen, you've got to put it back in front of yourself. Okay. So this this is how we play as a team. Yeah. Okay. No, that's good. So it's just going to be constant reminders. No, that's good. I'll work. So you're looking for anything out of the air. And then I'm switching because he kind of made me defend. So it's try not to reach in as much okay. when it's blowing behind the wind's behind you. When the wind is blowing that way, like they could reach in because that wind is going to bring it to their paddle. Here, by the time we get it, we end up hitting at the edge. We ended up popping it up. Yes. So just stay on Gordon till you feel like you need to defend. Out. There you go. Shark. <laughs> Jeez, it's working me. Okay, here we go. Switch at six, switch sides, because it's very different. There you go, that's yours. Nice. Okay, one, two, one, three, one. Okay, two, three, one. See, and, um, Heli will go from that outside to that forehand to that forehand. She had no problem doing that. Me, I've just learned throughout the years that it's just such a bad shot, you know? Yeah. Everybody gets killed once that person gets that forehand, yeah. So you gotta, it depends on that person, really. Okay, uh, two, one, two, three, one. Uh, that, it wasn't time. Okay. Oh, you. I see. Yeah. Two, three, one. It has to come back to me. So now. Perfect. Yeah. Okay, side out. Was it three two? Three three? I don't remember where I started. Yeah, so me, that's all I'm looking for. I'm looking for somebody to lift one up where I can get it. Yep. Yep. Yes, correct. Yes. Yes. Correct. That's the key. Wherever that ball is determines what we're doing, what our roles are. That's why we don't want to keep going, keep switching sides the whole time, because it'll confuse us, right? So he kind of got me, so I bailed out. Now I'm going to stay on her. And we want to stay on her. No. Good. 
So see how the the role changed, but we don't want to just keep changing that role because now we're blocker, workhorse, blocker, workhorse. Yeah. We want to be blocker, 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 blocker. Okay, workhorse. Yeah. Okay. Do we score or is side out? Okay. You? I should have got that. My bad. Okay. Yeah, that's why I don't like going to that forehand. So you can even bring that into her feet. You know, you're still going outside to outside or that right foot. Yeah. Giving anybody a volley, man, it's just, you get killed. Two, three, two. <laughs> right. So you're just looking for an opening. Okay, three, three, two. Three, three. You. So that you should have smoked. Okay. You, you. Oh, jeez. Okay. Yeah, because that was above the net. Give that a nice tap in front of yourself. So, okay, let me, that brings up a point. So why would you attack in front of yourself? I probably shouldn't have. No, we do. We want to attack. If you're going to attack, we want to attack in front of ourselves because if that person gets it, this person has a lot more time to respond. Okay. Okay. Me, I know where it's going. I hit it. I can respond quicker than if I smack it in front of you, whack. You know, you don't have no time to respond. I got you. So we typically, when we attack, we attack forward. We try to defend diagonal. Okay. That's a great school of thought. Like, where do I hit the ball? Defend diagonally, attack forward. Okay. And was, you know, pretty much in front of me. Yeah. Because yeah. if I would have attacked over here, then you're looking over here, he rips it, you're smoked. Yeah. You. So put that right back in front of yourself. Right? Because we're working that guy, he puts it short, just put it right back in front of yourself. Yeah, you feel it now? Yep, yep. Me? And then I go back in front of myself. Yep. See that? Yep. Now we have a, we know what we're doing here. Yep. It's the people that I can't stand playing with. There's the people that, Paul, you know, Paul knows it though. He's over there and then the next shot he's over there and then the next shot he's over there. There's no, no team. To how you're yeah, I call it, you're, somebody's playing singles and not doubles, you know. Okay, is it side out? Yep. Three, four? Three, five. So we want to know what we're doing. As long as I feel in control, I'm going to stay on her. Oh, good. Okay, four, five, four, five, one. So I have to bail. Now that's our new target. So let, okay. Yep. So notice that wind brings it in. So you got to pay attention to the elements. Okay, four, five, two. Okay. Yeah, it was. His was. Yeah. There we go. So you hit your shot and you didn't get ready, you know. 
So you kind of gave her a volley, you know, it's we're in trouble. You got to bounce it in front of their feet the best you can. Uh, we're in the right spot? No, I'm over here. Yeah. And that kind of stuff is just drilling, you know, just constant reps. Uh, out. Okay, good job, Vic. Way to stay in there. Second serve or side out? Okay, four, eight. Okay, you kind of got this? Yep. Okay, let's, let's play. Play, play. Play, play. Play, play. Yep. So here, typically, where would we... On that side, I almost like the return forward, but typically we're going to return in front of your partner, right? Return in front of your partner, that way I'm the blocker and I can block while you finally get up here. When we drop a third, we try to drop in front of our partner because then you, you're covering this gap the whole time. We're going to go over that. Okay, here we go. Zero, zero. Out. And we always make our, our serves are always in. Our returns are always in. Zero, zero. You. Good. So I'm up there just hunting. and You were feeding the hunter, you know. Yep. Great job. One, zero, one. Nice. So I'm always going to try to drop in front of you. Pretty much, yeah. Now that's the hey, blueprint. That's the blueprint. Yeah. Now, if it was a tournament, we kind of attack the weakest shot of the weakest player. Right. But this is the blueprint. Yep. So then we'd be attacking Gordon. Yeah. yeah. You. Yeah, and see how he hunted that, you know? Okay, two zero two. Me drop. You. Three zero two. No, I think it's out. Go. That one's out. Okay, good. I'm glad I hit it. Four zero two. You. Get up there. Nice. So, so here's this is important. Okay, go ahead and ask your question. Well, the worst case here, and it came up through here, I didn't think I had any choice just to make it through the video. Yeah, that's, that's all you had. That was your shot. Outside to outside was fine. Because you're not attacking, you're just right. putting in the kitchen. Anything in the kitchen, you're pretty safe. But what I want you to notice is, so I served, it was a return, you hit the third in front of yourself, right? Yeah, I, yes, I did. Because I did. that was the shot you had. So instead of me assuming you're going to hit it in front of me and going up, and creating a big hole, 
I saw where you hit it. I started moving and I stopped to let you get out ahead of me. Okay. So now we have this gap closed. Okay. Right? So, so the ball was on this side. Yes. It's so let's say you hit it. it. Yeah. And then so let's kind of go over it again mentally. So Right. So I, I saw you did that, so I stopped and went backwards so I can cover this gap. Now you go up to the line. Now see I have this covered now? Now, if, if you would have hit it in front of yourself, from here, let's pretend, you hit it in front of yourself, and I ran up, and the ball's there, look at that hole. Yeah, gotcha. So this person always has to be aware of what this person did. Okay. So once I saw you do that, boom, I backed up to cover this gap. So then the person, that's, the person that theoretically hits the ball is the person that is going to determine if the partner either moves up or he stays back. Because if I hit it, basically, I mean, like, you never... Yeah, I'm not going to touch the ball. I got to see this person who doesn't touch the ball has to watch what you do. Yes, this person has to, is always in the game watching what this person just did. So then even when you play rec ball, you can, you can cover this gap because, you know, they don't know what you're doing, but it's a way to practice this system. Okay, so I think it's 5-0. So the person who's not hitting the ball has to be aware, and they still have a role. Okay, five zero two. Me drop. Okay, so you need to be more yep, center. You're over here. That's too much. Too much room for me to. Right. This is your neutral. This is your neutral. Don't worry about over here. You can still get it. Yeah. And when you come up, you kind of come up neutral here because you came up wide. And even though I'm trying to fill a gap, there's still a huge hole. So this is our neutral. When we come up forward, when we come up this way, we want to go okay. to there. Gotcha. Okay, here we go. Yeah, it just is what it is. Yeah. And now if you hit it in front of yourself, then you're going to come up straight neutral and I'm going to shift into this and I might even back up to give you time to get up there. Okay, good. Okay, ready? Five zero one. Me drop. So you're too slow. Too slow. You need to get up and pressure. If this ball that I hit, if you see that it's gonna bounce, even off my paddle, I want you up okay. in their face. All right. I'm gonna come up slow. Okay. Because I can just reset it because I'm the workhorse. Okay. You're the hunter. You need to be up in front. Gotcha. Now, if I fly it up there, yes, you're gonna just stop. Gotcha. We're both gonna stop. Gotcha. Yeah. Yep. Okay, six zero. Okay, six zero one. Me okay, drop. I bail out. So now that's our new target. Let's stay on her. Out. Okay, yeah, you got it. Yes, this is important. Yep, yep, yep. And when you're up on this line, you don't have to move so much. You don't have to, because the ball was in front of you. We're kind of dinking in front of you. You're moving all over. It doesn't make sense. Just be up here ready. Okay. Yeah, because right. you, you, when you move sideways, you open the gap. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, let them make them hit down that line. Because I know I can get there. Yeah, Unless they have to hit the perfect shot. Gotcha. Okay, no, because I'm, yeah. We're covering highest percentage shots that we think they will hit. And as long as we're doing our job, that's all they have. Okay, 7 0, I think. One. Me, get ready. Go, 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 go. There. Right. I, mean, I would have still been here waiting to see what she's 
yeah, and there was a big hole. I still feel like you went too far that way. Correct. Be ready. Eight zero one. You. So there's nothing I couldn't go up. With. I couldn't do anything. You put the ball in front of you. So now I'm the workhorse. You can go up and punish them. Okay. But I gotta stay back. And now when you poked out there, I was there. Let that go. Okay. Yeah. Me. Ah, oh, man. So let's, real quick. I'm just, I'm talking way too much, but no, no. if I don't see again, I want you to know this. So that ball came about right here, right? So she talks about the Vs. So if that ball's in front of me, I'm blocker, right? Because even though she's returning, that ball's still in front of me. I'm the hunter. So that my V is anywhere, I can go get any ball that's up here, you know, right? My V extends all the way to here. It's a tight V. So you as the workhorse, your V is like, <laughs> you're facing the ball. So here's your V, it's wide. So if it gets, if she's returning here and it goes deep, that's your back end. But anything up here, I'm going to get. Does that make sense? Okay. Uh, we have eight. There you go. Try not to go in front of me. Try to poke in front of yourself. Yeah. Because if she would have caught that back in, boom, I have no time. Good shot. Nothing you can do about that. Right there. So I was the hunter. I was trying to get it. Excuse me. He went over a little bit further and I put you in your prime spot. Yeah. Because then we're playing pickleball. I, my system is whatever shot I hit, I know they have two shots coming back. I get ready for those two shots. That's a whole other level you're not ready for. So. Oh, you're taking my ball. You're taking my ball. You're yeah. taking my ball. And I said, no, I'm just trying to show you how to play the right way. Yeah. To the best of my opinion. So this, now you bring, hey, this is blocker workhorse. It determines whose ball it is. Right. There is no argument anymore, you know? That's why I like doing it with couples, because now, oh, he's taking my ball all the time. Well, no, that's his ball. Yeah. Or, oh, he's taking my forehand. No, that's his backhand, right? Okay, we got to make those shots that got to go over, right? There's no reason to miss that shot. So instead of just whipping it across, you know, because I know you're covering my middle here, I just put it in front of myself. I tried to do there. I said I tried to hit. I tried to hit a shot, and I didn't have to. I just need to get it over. Exactly. I'm not trying to hit a winner, right? Let them hit a loser. Yeah. Me. So there, I just became my own hunter. I put it in front of me. I try to get out in front of you, you know. So you got to pay attention and not be 
up ahead of me. Okay. You might have to back up even. Okay. You know? Because yep. I got to trust that my partner's got my back. So I, theoretically, I mean, if there's time, you should always be a little bit right. Yes. Okay. Yes. Right. Correct. And, and facing the ball. You? Right. So I saw, oh, your drop's going to be good, man. I just go pressure. Right? Yeah. Actually, you, when the ball goes in front of you, but yeah. when the ball goes in front of me, you can take your own sweet time coming up. You don't have to go anywhere. You're just here to get the cleanup and just keep resetting it back in front of me. That's I don't rush up on this third. Yeah, correct. As long as I put it in front of my partner, they're covering anything in the air. I'm going to get anything okay. off the bounce. I don't rush. Okay. Uh, okay. You. So you hit your shot and then you just boom, like blazed up and he caught you moving. Yep. Take your time. Okay. I'm up in front. Right. Once you hit that ball, it's not a good shot to stop. Hit the next one calm. If it's not good, stop. Hit it calm again. Okay. Yeah, too many people are just boom, out racing this ball. Right, Char? Uh, what are we, 10? 10-3, okay. 2. 10 four, two. Me, drop. See, you're way too slow. Yep. The ball's in front of you. Here, I'm the one going up slow then. Okay. Yep. Let's redo that scenario right there. So return to me, Char. Does that make sense? Yep. This is important, super important. Okay, now you're watching. Go, 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 go. And then, there you go. And I can take my time knowing you're up there. And I'm going to get anything because you don't want to be poking around out here. That's me. Boom. Coming up behind you. Okay, great job. Let's get a drink and switch sides. Thank you guys for coming out. This is just, just that alone is going to, if you don't get anything else out of this lesson, that is what you need. I know. Yeah, I'll move that out of the way. Yes. So we'll do one game on this side, and then I want to switch partners. Okay. So, you, okay. you know, because I know what I'm doing all the yeah, time. Yeah, no. So I want you to go with, I mean, they know too, but yeah. but this way in rec ball, you can practice being in the right spot, even when they don't even know what they're doing. Right, right. Yeah. Because otherwise it gets frustrating. Yeah. Okay. We always make serves. Always make returns. You. There. Nice. That's all you needed. Right at the feet. If you would have gave her a volley, it would have smoked me. Oh. 
There we go. Yes? I mean, I hit that like I was playing in a game. Should I just be trying to hit dinks instead of... No, that was perfect. You had an overhead. You hit it down at their feet. It was super safe, high percentage. If they got it, it was going to pop up and we got another one. What you don't want to do is hit it out the back, you know? Yeah. Okay, you, 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 you. Okay, reset. So I like how she retreated there. So just stay on her. There you go. Nope. Great job. That's all we needed, right? The volleys you gave her, she really didn't have an attack off it. They were good, you know, she could just defend. So you served and moved in and he yeah. caught you, yeah. One zero two. You? So you dropped in front of yourself, so I just, I stopped and let you get out ahead of me. Because yep. I got a cover behind you. And I just hit a piss high drop. Yeah, and that's okay. I just stopped. Yep, so I'm ready to defend. I'm letting you get out ahead of me. Yeah, I got you. Yeah? That's the main thing we need to know. Ready to hit. Yes. Not necessarily being close. Correct. Here's where you want to be close. Uh, yep. Okay. Yep. So on the return, we return and we get to that line. Okay. That's we want to return and get to that line. Now, if we have a bad return or something and they're going to hit it, we need to stop. Okay. Does that make sense? Yep. But for the most part, we're going to return and get to that line. No, because the return, somebody's already up there. Yeah, I got you. Yeah. Okay. What are we, one zero? Yeah, one zero. One zero one. Me, 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 me. So get in the hunter spot. So you probably should have been up there ready for that one. Ready for that one? Yeah. You're moving. You're moving around. I'm still moving through my turn. Yeah. Okay. I mean, I don't I don't mind the, the movement, but there's no reason to move that way. Okay. Because then you create holes. Because okay. she saw that big hole, you know. Uh, whatever. Me? Drop. <laughs> Out. Okay, good. Is it me? Two zero two or you? Me? Two zero two? No, it's Vic two zero two. Thank you. Okay, me? That's a drive. Take your out oh, kitchen. Kitchen. On Vic. So the wind's at your back. That's not, you yep. can't hit that shot. Okay. Yep. Perfect return. Deep, penetrating. So I want to hit and get up to this line. Go get it. That's in Wikipedia. I saw your eyes. You were like, you were like, I got her. 
Yeah, I, I was going to do something cool. But that's me. I attacked in front of you. You didn't have time to respond. So it was a bad shot on my part. Me? That's a drive. So why am I driving that? Because because it's this high and it's short and they don't have prime degree. Yeah, and usually anytime that person returns in front of themselves, I'm looking at a drive. Because typically I can beat them before they come up. Now I'm not trying to hit it out the back or rip their face off. Yeah, you're just saying that's the best defense. Correct. Offensive for the shot. Correct. Okay. Uh, three two. Okay, stop. So, what happened there? Where'd you hit your third? I don't remember. You hit your third in front of me, and you went up. So now you created that gap. Because yep. I gotta wait and see what you do. Yeah. Okay. So. Yeah, because I was up, and you were here, and I hit it back to him. Yeah. Yeah. So I can't do anything. Yep. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Vix. Thanks, Gordon. I bring Gordon to keep track of the score. <laughs> Me, drive. Right, so why did I drive it? This person returned forward in front of me. Yep, and it came up short. Yep. Now i got to determine whether it's drivable or droppable. Yep. But right away, if that person returns in front of themselves, I'm looking for a drive. Especially on that side, with my forehand, you know. What if it's deeper? I would have dropped it probably. Okay. Yeah. Uh, five. You? Yeah. So see, I couldn't, I couldn't yeah. go up yet. No, you're right. And, yeah. I, and I was. And you're dropping in front of yourself, so I still can't go up. Now, if you would have put one over here, I would have looked to come up. If it was high, I would have just stopped. Okay. Does that make sense? Yep. Yep. Yeah. So try to defend in front of your partner. Okay. It gives you the best chance. Plus it's cross, it gives you more room to work with. Okay? Yep. Five. <laughs> Thanks, Gordon. Five two two. Okay, you. Okay. So you dropped in front of yourself. I couldn't go up. You became your own blocker. I'm just the workhorse. And then you just missed that shot. Because she caught you moving though. Ooh, nice, Gordon. No, good coverage. So when you're when you're hunting, I want you on this line, basically leaning forward. You know, I want you ready because I'm going to get the lob. You're kind of back. Correct. See, I'm, I'm protecting you until yep. you get up there. So you're my protection right now until I get up there. You can go as far over as you want. Okay. All right. Yeah. Uh, three, five, three. Oh. Uh, I just hit an ambiguous shot in the middle. Okay. It's probably, that's why we clash paddles, okay. you know. Typically your ball. Okay, good job. Okay, five four. All right, five four one. Me drop. Don't back up. You're backing up. 
You're creating holes, man. Okay. Be up in the neutral position, Here. ready. Yes. Okay. You're kind of backing up and going left. Whoa, that's a big hole. Yep. Okay. yep. You're, you're moving too much where you don't need to be. Right. You don't need to be moving. Does that make sense? Yep, no, it does. And I'm, and I'm just I'm thinking, whoop, that's back far enough. I should give myself a little more room. No, you should be leaning forward. Yeah. Okay, uh, six, four? Yeah, six, four, one. Six, four, one. Okay, me, drop. You should be up there. You. So I had to bail on that one. Good, keep playing. You got it. <laughs> you got to be always ready, Vic. Like the workhorse, the hunter can look, but he might pull back. You, the workhorse, you got to play, make the play. And, I, and what I did was, I thought, well, he's got it, and I wasn't ready. Right. Gotcha. I'm always looking, but I can't always get there, especially with the wind. Yep. Uh, you, you, you. Seven, four, two. Yep, no out. Nice. Great, soft, delicate shot there. Great job. Thank you. Uh, nothing attackable, you know, nothing. Yep. That's how you play. Yep. You don't give them shit. <laughs> Frustrate. Drag them into the mud. That's what I call it. 7-4-1. Seven, 7-4-1. Four, one. Seven, four, one. You. You, 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 you. Oh, so you, you're going to see when you watch that video, you're all the way over here. Fuck that line, man. Yep. <laughs> Leave the line. Yeah. They got to prove that they can hit that, that shot so good looking, two or three times before you ever cover that line. Okay. Sorry about the cursing. That's all right. You. Uh, so that's kind of an ambiguous drop, so... I'm just going to kind of hang out with you, yeah. Yeah, and it's in, in the middle, yep. right? You? Yeah, you just panicked. Yeah. Soft, no panic, just soft. Okay, stay neutral. Be up there. And cover me till I get up there. There you go. You got it. Yeah, you had more time than you thought. That's just we relax. Relax. <laughs> you didn't think this game was this complicated, huh? Yeah. I'm glad it is. Yeah. You? Yeah, that's why I like this game because it's chess, you know. You can, at the higher level, everybody's great, so you got to outthink them. 8 5? 2. Okay, me. Drop. Watch the lob. It wasn't there. I don't think you're up. I hit a drop so perfect. 
And by the time it bounced, you were here. You should be here. I want you pressuring that person. They feel no pressure here. Okay. Now me, I'm going to come up slow, and I'm going to get anything that gets past you. I think I'm getting there quick. I'm not getting there quick enough. Yeah, not quick enough. Because I, I noticed before, I said, damn, if I'd gotten there just half a second quicker, I could have hit that ball here instead of driving into that here. So exactly. You, know, okay. you got to be able to read off somebody's paddle. Does that make sense? Yep. And maybe that's just something I'm super well, good at, well, but... Even, well, you are, because it's like, it's like the three R's, you know? You know, you get ready. I mean, yeah. you, you're ready, read, and you react. There right? you go. So what yeah. you're saying is, I'm not getting ready because when I read it, it's like, uh-oh, uh -oh, now what do I do? Yeah. Had I read it up here and been ready, my reaction would have been significantly different. Yeah, and then you pressure them. You yeah. Pressure. Okay, nine, I think. Nine, five, two. Okay, me. Out. He almost burned me. Ten five two. Okay, now watch this drop. Go 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 go. Yes. Yeah. Cause you and that's why I tell my partner, hey, I'm dropping, so they can read off my paddle. Nope, that's good. And get ready. That was perfect right there. And sometimes they'll just plain out miss once they see that body coming. Okay, let's get a drink, and then it's going to be, you're going to play with Char. There you go. Oh, yeah, I'm just going to smile. That sounds like a Okay, this is Vic. It's a lesson. So he's got dynamite doubles, uh, and I'm just trying to help him. What his role is, that's the main thing. When do I change my dink? What's my role as a partner? So that's really what we're working on. And wherever that ball is determines on your role, whether you're blocker, hunter, or you're the workhorse. That's what makes the difference. Once he gets that, that's probably the most important lesson he could get today. And then the rest is, you know, about thinking and trying not to keep redirecting for no reason. Every dink has a purpose. Interesting thing at the Islander is you don't own the land. They, the resort has a, I got like a 30 year lease of BLM. Which just got land. renewed, I think. So you actually pay pretty hefty fees. monthly HOA fees. Something. Like I think it's easier for you to play on that side. What do you think? Okay. The drops are easier? They have a bunch of park models, though. For sales. Yeah, park yeah. models. Huh? I thought you and I were playing together. No, oh, you and Vic. So I want him to have to read off of your shots. Okay. Okay. Uh, sure. Okay, that's good. So that one. Char, you hit the third, right? Yeah. Char hit the third. Okay, Vic, you hit the third in front of yourself. Char got up ahead of you, <laughs> right? She created a gap there. So if she outraces you, you have to stop and go back, you know? It's just, or try to get out in front of her somehow. You. Ah, uh, 
Good battle. So do you think you were defending on those dinks or being offensive? No, I think I was defending. That's time to ditch it. Yeah. He had you on your heels. I would dink to me. Does that make sense? Yep. And then I'd probably go cross court. So now you're back to being a hunter. Sure one. Oh. So that's one where it made sense to go here because I closed the distance. I'm up there. He's still coming up. You could have hit his feet on an easier shot. You could have followed through, but you tried to do something real difficult. That's what reading. We got to read where these teams are. Me? Drop. Good coverage. Okay, five zero two. Me drop. Oh, the winds at your back. Okay, six zero two. Me drop. Oh, Gordon, what the hell, man? I lost. Where's my hunter? You turned vegan on me. He turned vegan on me. He was looking for kale chips. <laughs> With a sorte, that one. <laughs> so that's that's where you, if you go outside to inside you're probably in trouble yep because yep. me as this player all I'm waiting on is that shit middle shot. I'm trying to set you up to give me that. Yep. You? Oh, nice drop. Gotta make sure my camera doesn't blow down. Seven oh two. Seven oh two. Oh yeah. Me. <laughs> With that wind, it's coming back. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, eight. Eight oh two. I know too. You. You. I wasn't ready for that. <laughs> nice shot. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, pro shot. Good serve. Okay, nine zero one. Me, drop. Uh, I saw you take off. Yeah, I think just that's where we need to know people. I like to drop in front of myself, you know. Yeah, that's where it gets confusing. But the more that's where the more you play with a partner, the better you learn them. Good job. There you go. That's you being up there, ready. You still got to get that shot, Vic. Did the right thing there, Vic. You just got ready, got the paddle down. That was good. Okay, nine one one. Me drop. One, one. Here we go. Oh, pro shot. Okay, let's go straight into Gordon and Gordon and Vic, me and Char. And then I think that's probably it. What time is it? Yeah, we'll just do one more. Yeah, I want to do one more. Okay, so let's pay attention to where we are. Got to play the elements. Come on. No. <laughs> no. Me. No. There you go. Hey, just set him up to hit out balls. Perfect. <laughs> you, you, you. Okay, two zero two. Me drop. Heads up, heads up, heads up. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta watch. watch. Yeah, you gotta. You got, should have saw that it's too high and went backwards. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Perfect. It was perfect. Yeah. If you have like an easy attack. Hitting that person right in front of you is perfect. If you're defending, then you would bring it back over here. You're moving, you're moving and hitting. Oh, wow. No, that's possible. 
Yeah, I don't know. It's pretty sloppy. Nice hands, Gordon. Yeah, so that's where I attacked in front of you where I normally wouldn't, right? Yeah. I just wanted to attack Gordon, basically. <laughs> but it did not pay off. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's yours, Vic, if you want it. Because that's your V. Was that good, Vic? Okay, good shot. I got a ball. Two, four, two. Man, drop. I kind of went over a little bit and you kind of camped out so I knew my hole was open but your dink was too good I shouldn't have hit it yes you need to recover correct So just remember, if this person returns in front of themselves, that sets you up for a nice drive. Or, or drove it at me. Yeah. Great job, Gordon. Hey, let's go ahead and switch sides since it's the last game. So I want you once you've rolled this film back, I want you to notice Gordon's just in the right spot every time right now. He's really covering covering his partner. Yeah. Okay, our turn. Our turn. Two seven. What a great drop. 
So that's where, if you play with the partner long enough, he's protecting you while you get up there. You don't want to rush up on him. Okay. You want to either go slow or go out wide. Correct. And he, and that's what happened to me. That's what I saw. Yep, I, I think you're yeah, he felt you, and then yeah. yeah. Yes. Exactly. Okay, where are we? All right, three, seven, two. You, you, you. There we go. Four seven two. <laughs> that ball like didn't go anywhere. I need Shar, go get it. <laughs> Come on, Shar, get on your heart. I'm gonna tell David that there's a faulty tile that sweet spot doesn't. Oh, okay. <laughs> You need to be ready. You're still in that last shot. It's so big, you're not able to recover. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, everything was right, except you just missed that dink. I felt when you came up, it was perfect. You took your time, you just hit the shots, it's great. You. You? So were you thinking drive, but it was on your back end? No, yep. Yeah. What a shot. So you like hanging out on that corner. Well, okay, because who was serving there? I served. Four nine. We served. Yeah. Okay, I return. So serve, return, comes to me. I hit a third at you. But for some reason, you like being here. Is it because you like playing your backhand? I don't know. Because I would be here, because if this person returns forward, have that because you're lining up here I return forward but now unless your backhand's better than your forehand you didn't have anything got you I got you yeah yep, then, I had, then I tried to hit it then I tried to hit the correct got you. does that make sense yep. Well, yep. And the other thing right is that it's he's dropped in front of him leaves a big gap yeah right? huge gap spot yeah. is about where he is now right? yeah that's where I should have been yep. I would be more neutral Okay, I want her to serve again. Go back. Okay. We're going to do it over. No, it was good. It was good. Okay, I want Gordon to serve. This is the scenario, yes. What am I supposed to be doing? 
No, that's it. <laughs> so that's that was the scenario I was trying to set up. You were serving, and you were on this corner over here. Okay. That time you went neutral. You yeah. still took it with your back end. No, no, I hit that with my foot. Uh, yeah. So here's where. Before you were on that corner, right? Yes. So. Correct. Correct. So now I want you more middle. I want you looking for a forehand here. Okay. Because you can always, if I return there, who cares? Because you're going up, right? But here I want you looking for the drive. You should be looking for a drive right here, right now. There you go. Let's play it out. <laughs> okay, so let's go back to where we were. So now we're what, 491? Yep. Okay. Yeah, 491. Great job. Perfect. Perfect. You're reading the room. That's exactly it. Okay, 492. Me. Okay, here we go. Short. Ah, oh, fudge. Great job. Thank you. Yeah, I feel now once you watch that, it should have recorded all the way through. And start, you can't really watch the pros because they're just so fast, they're going to do whatever. But when you watch rec players and watch our videos, you'll be able to see where you need to be, where that ball is. Oh, there I'm the hunter. Yeah. Oh, I went up in front of my person. I caused a gap. This was just exactly what I was hoping I could do was to get some of that kind of information. So thank you. Yeah, that's, that's what I thought you needed because you got the game. You just need to know where to be and how to hit the highest percentage shots and be ready for the highest percentage shots back. We don't. We don't cover 10% shots. We cover the 80%. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah. All right, CoachDavidLive.com. Thanks, Gordon and Char. Thanks, Char. Okay.